you come across the term digital marketing? Do you even wonder what it is all about? What is digital marketing? Why are they always talking about it? Is it useful for businesses? Can this be learned easily? If you do, sit back and relax because for our video today, we will talk about the beginner's guide for digital marketing. Hi, welcome to Cash Baggy. In this channel, we will talk about income opportunities, side hustles, online income stream, and financial security. Security. All in all, let's talk about money. Now, what is digital marketing? You have seen ads on social media, right? You know, the ads that play before the actual audio starts on YouTube. Those that suddenly appear in Facebook newsfeed or stories. The sponsored posts that suddenly appear on TikTok. And those that pop up even in Instagram and Twitter. Even when searching for something on Google, the first thing that you will see in an advertisement. You can also receive promotional materials via emails, text messages, mobile apps, and websites. It's everywhere. And that right there is digital marketing or online marketing. Digital marketing is simply marketing carried out digitally. Yup, that's pretty much it. This means that the same ideas, rules, and theories that apply to marketing your company will use but will be now applied on digital platforms like social media, email, and other online channels. Basically, digital marketing is when you use a digital platform to let your customers know how valuable your business is. You can find people who are interested in your offering through digital marketing, engaged with them, and develop brand loyalty. There are many different types of digital marketing, but the most significant ones are content marketing, search engine optimization, PPC advertising, social media marketing, email marketing, affiliate marketing, and marketing through videos and social media. Now, I know that those may be some unfamiliar words, but don't worry, let's discuss that. Do you have a business and you don't know how to start with digital marketing? You just have to relax. Having a general understanding of all the different components will help you succeed in today's digital marketplace because, at the end of the day, digital marketing is quite simple. Of course, there are some more complicated and technical aspects involved with digital marketing. But that doesn't mean you need to know what they are all about and how to do them. Why is it important? To make your business thrive with a lot of competition in the market, you must use the power of digital marketing. In this modern time, everyone is already using a phone. Almost everyone has social media accounts. With the internet's accessibility, the number of users is increasing every minute. Connecting with your audience at the proper time and place has always been the goal of marketing. Where is the easiest place to connect with audiences? Online. That is why digital marketing is very important for businesses nowadays. Now that we have discussed what is digital marketing and why is it important, let us now move on to the how. How does digital marketing work? Whether the goal is to entice customers into making a purchase, increase their brand awareness, 
or simply engage them with your brand, digital marketing employs various strategies to reach customers. As we just discussed, digital marketing functions very similarly to offline or traditional marketing. In fact, when you hear someone refer to digital marketing, they usually refer to the tools and the online and digital aspects of those tools rather than the underlying strategy, which should always be based on fundamental marketing principles. Let's now examine how various forms of digital marketing can be incorporated into an online marketing campaign. And let's see how you can get started in digital marketing. You already know the potential of digital marketing, right? You already know that potential customers are out there scrolling through their social media accounts. So how to get started? As you can remember, there are different kinds of digital marketing, right? Content marketing, search engine optimization, PPC advertising, social media marketing, email marketing, affiliate marketing, and marketing through videos and social media. You will use all of these types of marketing for your digital campaign, or you can skip some. It is still better to do all of this if you want to reach many customers. The first step that you need to do is to identify your target market. Whether we're talking about traditional or digital marketing, the first step is always to figure out your ideal customer, prospect, or potential person. Now, this is such a vital part of a strategic campaign because if you don't have the right person in mind, nothing else will really matter. So, spend some time and do some research on your ideal target market. Find out their age, gender, income, occupation, and similar things. Most importantly, find out their attitudes, interests, opinions, and behaviors. The next step is to create a website. This will help you promote your company, goods, and services. It doesn't need to be fancy, but it should be quick, responsive to mobile devices, simple to use, and could provide users with a beautiful experience. Website marketing is all about doing this. All digital marketing campaigns revolve around a website, which also serves as your brand's online presence. That is just the beginning. The first type of marketing we will discuss is content marketing. Online content is used for marketing purposes in the digital age. You can use various content types to attract the audience and pique interests in your brand, including blog posts, videos, images, and podcasts. This is the primary goal of content marketing. Now that you have identified your target market, you must know their needs and wants. Also, it is vital to understand their fears, frustrations, pains, nightmares, and everything they're trying to avoid. In this way, you can include it and say it in writing your content. For example, do you want to have clear skin? It is so frustrating to see your face full of impurities, right? Don't worry, we have the right product for you. The want, need, and fears are included, right? Another tip in creating content is making sure to follow what is viral on social media. In this way, you will have more audiences. 
The next thing that you need to do is SEO marketing. The process of increasing both the volume and quality of traffic to a website from organic search engine results is known as search engine optimization or SEO. Understanding SEO requires knowledge of how search engines operate and how internet users browse the web and conduct online searches. The content of a page must match the user's intentions for it to be optimized for search engines. In other words, it ensures that your content will remain relevant to your intended audience. Use various SEO strategies to persuade search engines that your website deserves to appear at the top of the list for keywords related to your client's industry. The best online marketing strategy is SEO because it can bring you highly targeted visitors without costing you a dime. But it takes time to develop. Are you learning from this video so far? Please share your thoughts in the comments section below. And hey, if you are still new to our channel and you love our topics, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. The next step you need to do for your campaign is PPC advertising. PPC advertising allows you to display your ads on thousands of websites, including those that are a part of the Google Advertising Network as well as at the top of Google search results. You will be required to pay the advertising platform a fee each time a user clicks on an advertisement and goes to your website. Not all users will see your ads, only those who are actively looking for information about your offerings will. This type of advertising is a little costly, but it will surely reach thousands of potential customers. The next step is the most common type of social media marketing. As the name suggests, social media marketing entails using social media platforms to attract customers and increase sales. These include Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. You need to be present where your potential customers hang out to extend your reach further. And there is no better place to do this plan on social media. There are billions of active users on social media who could be interested in your brand. These platforms have advertising tools you can use to target users with image and video ads based on their location, interests, and demographics. You can begin engaging with them as your audience grows and more people will visit your website. After this step, here comes email marketing. The most popular form of communication and a very powerful sales channel is email. This is more of a personal approach. You have already piqued their interest. And the next thing that you should do is to convince them to buy your products through email marketing. You don't have to pay for anything to advertise via email. All you need is time. But if you don't have that, there are a lot of software that can make it automated. You don't have to do everything manually and message each of your potential customers. Messages will automatically send based on your liking. Video marketing comes next on the list. Before making a purchase, Many users visit video-based websites like YouTube, TikTok, and others. You can benefit from this by producing incredible videos 
that assist viewers in finding solutions, making decisions, or just having fun. In addition to being a fantastic sales channel, video marketing is one of the best ways to raise brand awareness and create a following of devoted customers. Affiliate marketing is the final but most effective form of advertising that you can employ. One of the earliest forms of marketing, affiliate marketing has expanded significantly with the growth of the internet. The process is simple. You will pay others a commission to promote your products to their audience and website. This translates to more sales, while your affiliates continue earning a commission on each sale. In addition to being a great way to boost sales, affiliate marketing also allows you to have the best brand ambassadors. And that is just how simple digital marketing is. You can use all these strategies and you can also just select one depending on your budget. But remember, spending on digital advertising and getting your potential customers is worth it. What do you think about this topic? Do you agree with us too? Do you think digital marketing is pretty simple? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next video.